Hello, this is R-I-C-K-Y, the YouTube tech guy. Today I'm here to show you Newegg's brand new tool for finding laptops. And after weeks of intense R&D, we decided to call it Laptop Finder. I know, right? But seriously, this is the best way to shop for a laptop online and puts all the other tech websites to shame. Let me show you how it works. We have the simple approach and the tech guy approach. The simple approach is using just the top to find out what you need. It's very simple, you just pick what you're using. So I'm using this laptop for home use. Probably want a thin and light one with a long battery life. And let's say my budget is under $1,000 and then just click apply. And now we have it. Everything here set up in columns from your screen size to your weight, to your memory, to your storage, everything you could possibly be looking for. And then from here, we could just sort by what we're looking for. So we can go by best selling, most reviews, highest price. Let's for this one go newest to oldest. So I want something newer that came out more recently. In this case, I will go with the Surface Go. I've heard good things about it. This one has an i3 processor, eight gigs of RAM, 128. Good price point. So from here, I can just click add to cart and that's all I need to do. Just go ahead and buy. But then there's the tech guy way, which is a lot more fine tuning. First off, I'm only gonna touch the budget that's on top. I will do it to about 2000 in this case, cause I'm looking for a laptop that is not only gaming, but also content creation. So I don't wanna leave any out in this case. I'm just gonna narrow it down to being a budget under 2000 and then we'll see what I have. And this is the part that I really love as a tech enthusiast that I can just edit this. So you can go to customize right at the top right and edit the columns that actually matter to you. Because some things I don't care about, color, number of cores, CPU speed, touchscreen, etc. don't care about those. So let's go ahead and edit those down and take them out. And this just makes it really easy. Also, some of them I am going to edit out entirely, like operating system, graphics card type, and some that I don't care about, like touchscreen. I have my laptop dock most of the time. So all this stuff I can just take out to a point where it's exactly what you're looking for and nothing else. Then click apply. And now these columns are a lot more fine tuned for you. Now I'm gonna fine tune what I want on the left side to get exactly what I want. And the thing I love about this is you can click multiple things to be applied at the same time. So first thing I wanna do is narrow down the memory. I only want 16 gigs and up for the memory. And instead of clicking apply here, I'm gonna scroll further down. And I know for the operating system, I'm gonna want Windows. Don't care if it's Windows 10, 11, or just regular Windows. Graphics type, I'm gonna want dedicated card, of course. And that is the things that are gonna really matter to me. So click apply from here. And this will narrow it down a lot more to have everything exactly what I'm looking for. Okay, now I'll set the lowest price for my next priority because sometimes you have to tech on a budget. And from here, I'm seeing a lot of MX series and GTX series GPUs. And I know I want a little bit more power than that for my editing. So I can narrow it down a little bit more. I'm gonna go on the left side over here again, and I'm going to pick NVIDIA GeForce, and I'm gonna pick all the 30 series that I see. So it looks like I can go anywhere from 3050, 3050 Ti, and 3060 for this price range. So I'm gonna click apply. And now, as expected, my budget starts around a thousand. So I can easily compare and see what I want. All right, so right here we have some MSI creators, which I like, some Asus laptops, and I can kind of play around to see what else there is that I'm looking at. So I think I'd rather stay with under six pounds if I can help it. This MSI creator right here has an 11th Gen i7. So if I go a little bit higher in price, I can see this Ryzen 7, 5000 series, 3050 Ti, and four pounds. This might definitely be a contender because I would have to jump all the way over here. Oof, again, it's six pounds. So yeah, it's not gonna be a perfect system for you because you are gonna still have to find exactly what you're looking for. But for me, I might actually land at this MSI Prestige right here. It has a 12th Gen i7, 16 gigs of RAM, 3050 Ti, which I like, 
and five to 5.9 pounds plus two Thunderbolt fours. So that is really good for me. So I think I will land on that. I really just like how this tool works. If you don't know anything about tech, it can be extremely easy. Just pick the categories and your budget and you're set to go. It's the best way to shop for a laptop that I've seen yet. So let me know what you think in the comments section down below. Thank you as always for watching. This has been R-I-C-K-Y, the YouTube tech guy.